He was a New York businessman who traveled to Eretz Yisrael, to Yerushalayim. He went to the Sabaro pizza store to buy lunch for himself. He was online. There was Israeli in front of him. And he was in a big rush, this New York businessman, so he asked this Israeli in front of him, can I please go ahead of you? I need to get to a meeting. The Israeli turned around and said, no problem, please, you can proceed. So he did, the New York businessman went ahead, he ate his lunch. He then walked outside the Sabaro pizza shop when he heard the largest explosion he ever heard in his entire life. He realized that this Israeli just saved his life by letting him go ahead of him. He wanted to show his Akkara Satoyu to somehow thank him for saving his life. He wanted to get back inside the store, but of course he couldn't. He went from hospital to hospital until he finally found this Israeli man severely injured. He waited over there and he said to Hillel, until the injured man's son walked into the door. The son said to him, who are you? He said, listen, your father, he saved my life. If there's anything I can do for you, here's my card. Don't hesitate to call. A few months went by when the injured man's son called this New York businessman and he said, his father needs to come from Israel to Boston Hospital for a special operation. Can you help me? The New York businessman said, not only will I help, but I'm going to go together with you to see this entire procedure. Sure enough, the day came, the surgery was very successful, and it was in the waiting room where this New York businessman was watching the news, and his face turned white. They asked him, what is it? What's going on? He goes, you don't understand. Had I not been here today with your father at this surgery, I would have been where I always am, are on a weekday, and that is on the 101st floor of the World Trade Center. That day was 9-11-2001. This man was saved yet again. We see the incredible Ashkafa Pratis, the Siyat of the Shmaya, the Rabbani Shalom has for all of us. The song is called, You're Watching Me, composed by Yitzhi Walker.
Yeah.